a black man in the wine industry, you obviously are the minority. You are the one. You're being judged. You're being looked at. I feel the industry doesn't want to tell that story. There's challenges every day about being a black man in the wine business. The wine industry in Oregon is a very white-driven, androcentric kind of environment. Very seldom do you see people of color. What difference does it make what color is the person who makes my wine, right? But we still need to continue the conversation because people are really stupefied and dumbfounded when I show up. We have so many other minorities, not just African Americans, women, Hispanic, and the whole LGBT community as well. A lot of people tell me that when I became winemaker, I'm a pioneer because there are not really a lot of Hispanic winemakers in the industry. Being a woman-owned business makes us a minority. Being a gay-owned business makes us a minority. Being a Jewish-owned business makes us a minority. I think that's okay. <laughs> At the end of the day, that's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to change the face of the next 50 years of winemakers, wine drinkers, wine consumers, and the industry alike.